Hey guys, it's Sean here, and um, I'm going to be doing a little bit of a different video today. Um, it's not going to be a reaction, or it's not going to be music. Um, well, my microphone isn't working for music anyway, so it wouldn't be that. Anyway, 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 anyway. Um, I thought, because I made this video um, a little while ago, uh, maybe a couple of years ago now, um, I was talking about depression awareness and um, like talking about my own experiences um, with depression and surrounding depression um, with my friend obviously committing suicide uh, and that was a very hard time, the video was very hard to make talking about the subject um, but I went on and I'd done it and it's, it's all good now um, kind of moved on a little bit. It still comes to me whenever that month comes up, but it's fine. Um, so I thought because it's been a couple of years, I was going to do one last year, but then I was in the state of mind of making videos and stuff. Um, but now I am. I'm making videos. I'm quite, I wouldn't say consistent, but like I'm um, uploading regularly now um, so yeah um, so I thought I would do this again uh, I think it was like from two years ago so we'll do this again anyway so since that video that I made I've had a lot more experiences and dealings with depression um, my dad, obviously a couple of years ago as well, I think after I made that video, my dad went into hospital um, after having a mini stroke, uh, which we didn't know was the case. Um, so, but he got out of that in three days, so that was good. Um, but now he's um, really badly hurt his shoulder. Uh, and we think it's going to be arthritis or something like that. But anyway, back on the depression. Um, the few dealings that I've had with it. Um, obviously my girlfriend, one of the best girls in the world. The best girl in the world. I, I don't know what I'd do um, without her now. But she has depression. She has mental health issues. Like anxiety, depression, stuff like that. Um, and there's a few like instances with her that have kind of been difficult to go through. Um, especially when during the day she could be the happiest person alive, she could be hyper, she could be joking with you, she could be laughing, smiling and doing all that. And then it gets to a certain time or something and then it just all changes and she becomes... Um, she thinks that she doesn't want to be here anymore, the world would be better without her and obviously I'm there to help her through that um, but it's pretty hard over distances so I found that to become a bit difficult for me to stay on top of um, and like keep, a, keep an eye on um, because sometimes I can't be here, I can't be on my phone all the time, I can't be messaging folk all the time, I can't be messaging her all the time. So it's a bit difficult um, in that situation. But um, my brother, I don't know if he wants this out there or not, obviously probably not, but I'll tell you a little bit about it, I won't go into detail because it's a very personal thing. Um, but basically, last Monday, me, my dad and my mum stopped him from committing suicide pretty much. Um he was running up the forest and he was gonna he was gonna go kill himself. But I I chased him up the forest and he he stopped, he turned round and he he came back, he went to the hospital and stuff. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go into detail again with what happened but um, it seems to be a little bit better now, um, especially since yesterday we went out shopping and stuff uh, for his 21st birthday. Um, so yeah, that was, I think, 
that may be a little bit sorted now. But I've been kind of having my own thoughts recently. Um, like, not even like thoughts, it's just sitting here being bored and then I go into my thoughts and I get upset for no reason um, and stuff like that. Um, uh, I feel like I was sitting here the other night and I feel that um, I was just lonely, like my girlfriend wasn't uh, on messaging her or snapchat or that so I couldn't message her, um, I couldn't message anybody else because I've lost touch with everybody. I just felt lonely, I felt like I was on my own, I didn't feel like anyone was there that I could open up to and talk to and stuff. So, I don't know. But, the reason I'm making this video is awareness. Um, if you know someone, or if you are going through depression, anxiety, mental health issues of any sort, please find help. Go to a doctor, go to the hospital, go see your local GP or where we are as a GP. Um, but go see someone, even if you, you're just talking to your best mate or your mum or your dad or a doctor or a teacher at school or a uh, tutor at college or something like that. Just get the help you need because I wouldn't like to think that people's first option is to go and commit suicide because... That would be very hard to take. Um, but even if you feel comfortable opening up to, well not opening up, but talking to me, I'm always here. Um, I'm always on something, whether that be Twitter, Instagram. Um, I, I won't say Messenger because that's like a personal Facebook account. Um, but I'm always on Twitter and Instagram. So if you, if you at me or if you DM me, then I'll... I'll get back to you uh, as soon as possible, and we'll chat about it. We'll see if you become if you can become um, better and stuff. You know what I mean? Anyway, it's I don't know where I was going with this video. I just want to tell you to please get help or please find help for someone if you know they have depression. I will leave a link in the description for you to donate to um, a mental health charity. Um, whichever one I find, whichever one's the most popular and stuff, so I'll do that, uh, I'll donate to it as well because obviously that's the whole reason I'm making this video, but yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one, goodbye.